What a year it was for this Sound of Accra podcast. Thank you all for tuning in in this episode. If this is your first time listening, once again, my name is Adrian Daniels and this is the Sound of Accra podcast, the show where we chat with colourful creatives and entrepreneurs from a Ghanaian heritage or interest, promoting global Ghanaian excellence to the world. Now, I just want to do this episode to recap what we've accomplished in 2021. Um, a little bit of a preview or taster into what you can expect in 2022. Um, before I go into this episode, I would like to say pa, Happy New Year to all my listeners, wherever you are listening. Um, it's been a fantastic year. I mean, um, we've accomplished so much this year. Um, it's like each year we get bigger, we get bigger, better, we get more awareness and more countries continue to discover the sound of a crowd podcast uh 2021 it was great to see uh listeners from japan listeners from jamaica and um, this is incredible uh listen to the sound of a crowd podcast it just really goes to show that uh Ghanaian excellence is of interest around the world and is also located around the world and this has been the whole mission right from the beginning in january 2020 recording my first ever episode of Bontui and Yete. If you haven't listened to the episode, please go listen to it. Um, we'll leave it in the show notes for this episode. And uh, yeah, um, if you want the show notes for this episode, uh, feel free to head over to the sound of a forward slash 2022. And uh, if anybody wants the show notes, we'll leave a little bit of information there. So yeah, um, 2021 has definitely showed the evolution in the Sound of a Crowd podcast brand. Um, I, I am also, um, yeah, um, I know you guys wanted to probably get an episode this week. Um, but yeah, this week we just decided just to let the team rest and um, we'll bring out an episode next week, which was supposed to be the Christmas episode. Um, but yeah. Um, unfortunately yeah there was no episodes this week i know a little bit of momentum has been lost but it's okay um we're doing pod bites instead this week okay um so yeah 2021 has definitely showed an evolution in the sound of a crowd podcast brand it's now two years since i started this podcast adrian daniels and i'm still in the motherland where all of this started uh, for those of you who are regular listeners um when i dropped the pod bite episode um talking about Kotka International Airport um I have recently entered the country and I'm still here in January 2022 it's such a blessing to be back in the motherland um for all of these weeks and months and I will continue to be here for quite some time um by the grace of God so yeah um blessings to all of you people who have entered into 2020 2022 what am I saying 20 22 that's definitely gonna be a tongue twister for a lot of you out there um yeah give yourself a clap uh, uh, give yourself a tap in the back um smile uh, be grateful for what god has done for you guys in the previous year and um, be hopeful prayerful and grateful in advance for what he will do for you in this year um which is yet to be unfolded um so yeah i'm um, thank you to all the existing and new listeners um, people that have left reviews on Apple Podcasts. If you got an iPhone or iDevice, please leave us a review. It does go a long way and it helps this podcast to get ranked better. Um, so please do help help us by sparing a few moments to do that. Now you can also leave a review on Spotify. I believe it's star ratings. If you're listening on Spotify, I know there's a lot of Spotify listeners out there according to my anal analytics and analytics, sorry. I don't know what's going on today. Uh, but yeah, uh, please leave us a review on Spotify if you're listening and wherever you're listening to this platform, wherever you're listening to this episode, what platform you're using, please leave us a review. Uh, whether it's YouTube, uh, subscribe, like, share, comment, um, whether it's another platform like Pod being please leave us a review comment share let us know that you're liking the show let us know what you don't like let us know um, what you're getting from it so we can continue to deliver and fine-tune the best possible content right into uh, your podcast platform or youtube okay uh, thank you to all those who have featured in the show uh, 
in 2021 or even made an introduction to me who have featured on the show you all know who you are i don't really want to mention names in this particular case but thank you to all of you who have made a contribution to making uh, this year uh, successful so that's season two and um, the beginning of season three in terms of 2021 so um, we're going to get straight into the show. I know it's been a few minutes since I've been talking. Um, so yeah, um, let's get into some quick recap highlights from this year. Um, of course, if you um, want to keep listening, you can do. If you're bored already, then switch off. Um, so of course, we have rebranded the show with a brand new logo. Um, those of you who have listened from the start have definitely um, been in touch with me regarding the evolution of the brand and people have now been impressed um, with the new branding and have definitely seen the evolution of where the brand was. Um, the first logo was designed on Canva and this um, season three, we've decided to take things up a new level and we hired a professional logo designer to do it. Um, I have designed logos in the past, but it's not really my thing. So I decided to commission a logo designer to get this done. And what a designer it is, what a designer is. Uh, thanks to all of you who helped me to pick out the right design. And yeah, it really does stand out and makes people take the podcast more seriously. And uh, I'm now we're more of a brand to be reckoned with, which is great. <laughs> So yeah, um, absolutely. The podcast can now sit alongside some great other shows comfortably and stand out. I know some of you asked about merchandise, which in the right time we will start to roll out. Uh, we also launched a brand new YouTube channel. Um, so one of our advisors recommended that we move YouTube content from my personal channel, Adrian Daniels, to a brand new YouTube channel in its own right. Um, this is great because I want to release some own content in my own personal YouTube channel when the time is right soon, which isn't related to the Sound of a Crowd podcast. And so this is a great idea and a great um, decision for us moving forward. And as a result, YouTube channel growth is, is growing, um, is growing well. And uh, thank you to our advisors. I'm about to hit 100 subscribers soon, which is which sounds like nothing, um, but if you if any of you out there have a youtube channel um you wouldn't you would understand how hard it is to even just get to 100 subscribers without a big influence it is not easy but um thankfully the content that we've been putting out from season three which has just gone another level for those of you who've been watching on youtube um if you haven't just search the sound of a crowd podcast on youtube subscribe check it out um it's really doing um us wonders and it's really catching a lot of views um, so yeah, um, so we have a new team now. So after doing pretty much everything myself for season one or two, um, I decided to take profits from my podcast training program to reinvest into a team. So now we have a video editor, a social media manager, and a, and a videographer slash advisor. And this has certainly freed me up to focus on the guests and content and strategy of the show. A massive thank you to James, Ken and Simba um, to help me um, make season three the success it has been so far. Uh, we look to add more people to the team in 2022, God willing, as we continue to grow and get more known worldwide. Um, it's my mission to make the Sound of a Crowd podcast a household name around the world. Um, so yeah, if you're if you're interested in working in podcasting or radio and want some experience, want to volunteer, want to maybe intern, um, yeah, just get in touch, drop me an email, info at the sound of a crowd podcast. No, sorry, info at the sound of a crowd dot com and I can get in touch with you and see if you're a good fit for the team and see what we can do in terms of um, giving you a reward. Um, for joining as a volunteer or intern uh, when we do open up some more paid roles soon um, we will also um, make an announcement about that too so we've broken a few records so we've accumulated over thousands of impressions of views on linkedin and our instagram social media channels youtube shorts have also proved to perform well um, we've definitely been a bit more aggressive with our content strategy and our outreach strategy and vertical videos also helped to be doing us the trick now if you aren't following us on social media be sure to search for the sound of a crowd podcast on instagram facebook linkedin and youtube and check us out all of those channels we've acquired some new partnerships and sponsorships so as some of you may already know we've secured a new sponsor ice cream and ting a luxury ice cream brand in the uk providing ice cream 
flavors inspired by an African and Caribbean continent. If you are in the UK, you've got to try them out. These can be delivered straight to your door. Flavors include plantain, avocado, strawberry, and much more. Visit icecreamandting.com and get your order placed. Um, I've got the links in the show notes if you guys want to check them out through there instead. Uh, we've got some bigger guests this year for sure okay so this year we've had some great guests from hollywood to actors best-selling authors to entrepreneurs making waves in ghana and around the world we've attracted bigger guests in 2021 and we can't wait for you to hear some of the interviews we've been done and have been planning for 2022 be sure to sign up to our mailing list on the com or follow our instagram for exclusive content and behind the scenes footage and uh yeah one last one i'm gonna give i don't want to make this episode too long is more testimonials so we've definitely received a lot of instagram dms and messages and word of mouth comments based on um how people enjoy the show and yeah it really touches me to hear that people listen relate and can extract some value from the show so yeah please continue to listen share the episodes with friends and family who you think will benefit that's it that's a quick wrap up of 2021 and um, a little bit of what you can expect for 2022 uh, we hope you enjoyed the sound of a crowd podcast in 2021 here's to 2022 thank you so once again please leave a review on whatever platform you listen to this episode on subscribe on youtube um, help us to get to 100 subscribers We're only a few subscribers away guys i think we have 91 uh, so yeah we're very very close um, once we hit 100 subscribers youtube will um, unlock a few things for us so hopefully that would then propel our growth to a thousand plus subscribers and, and to go from there subscribe to us in the mailing list share with friends and family and, and by the way if there's anything or anyone that you want to see in the show in 2022 or if you think you are a good fit for the show uh, please make me an introduction or drop me an email at info at the or just or just get in touch with us on social media as a lot of people prefer to do that instead so that's all for me guys thank you so much uh, for tuning in the sound of a crowd podcast in 2021 uh, happy new year and all the best for 2022 and please keep it locked here thank you so much cheers